The sunrise on 2017 found us in a moment of inhalation, a breath between grief for the past and anticipation of the future. It was a quiet stillness Emily, Penny, and I shared together. But whatever it is we are meant to be, Penny reminded me we are not meant to be still. After beginning so many journeys with a full heart, we began this one on empty, determined to fill it along the way. We took a chance on ourselves and on a boy in an orange collar. Beginning at zero with zero just felt right. And it was through him we began to find our way. Penny showed her little brother how to hunt treats, and we also showed him how to hunt ferocious lions. We spend our lives in search. We say we're looking for love or money or success or some other word. In truth, we're always just looking for ourselves. And it was through zero I found myself. Not the self I had lost, but the self I needed to be. And needed for what exactly? Well, for a little pup named Lincoln, for starters. People said I was crazy. A baby, a big puppy, and a penny mayhem all at once. It seemed like, to many people, a recipe for crashing and burning. But for me, it was exactly the fuel I needed to kickstart my heart. The bit of preparation and forethought, Link was welcomed into the pack both on walks and on the couch. The pups were even kind enough to give him a metaphorical and a very literal crash course in dog beach etiquette. And when it got cold, well, we just bundled up and hit the beach. And when it got really ridiculously cold, well, we just got ridiculously bundled up and took a quick trip to Antarctica. This was our lesson in 2017. Persistence. You're not always gonna get things right, like when Zero tried breastfeeding from Penny. In fact, you're gonna get plenty of things wrong, like leaving a puppy unattended with a feather pillow. Mostly, you're gonna do a whole lot of things you're not sure what the outcome will be. And quite often, you'll feel like you're going in a circle. But what's most important is that you keep going. You figure out how to be comfortable with discomfort in order that you may keep growing. Sure, it's exhausting at times, but the prize is worth it. It's not a ribbon or a check or something anyone can hand to you. It's the knowledge that love endures for as long as you find the courage to keep putting one foot in front of the other. With the sunset on 2017, we begin this year with a wild and vibrant moment. Yet I'm still as uncertain as ever about where I'm going. Luckily, I have these dogs and this family reminding me to always take the next step.